In this video, we're going to talk about how to draw the Lewis structure of NH3. As always, we want to add up the valence electrons in this molecule first. Nitrogen has five valence electrons. How do we know this? Well, if you look at the periodic table, you'll find that nitrogen is in group 15 or group 5A of the periodic table. Hydrogen is in the first group, so it has one valence electron, but there's three of them. So we've got to multiply that by three. Five plus three is eight. So ammonia has eight valence electrons. Now, how can we draw the Lewis structure? Well, it's good to deal with hydrogen because hydrogen can only form a single bond. That's it. So we can just simply connect nitrogen with the three hydrogen atoms through a single bond. Now remember, every single bond represents two electrons. So far we have two, four, six electrons. We need two more to get to eight. So we gotta add a lone pair to the central nitrogen atom. So that's the Lewis structure of NH3. Now in terms of its molecular geometry, it has a trigonal pyramidal structure. The bond angle of NH3 is 107 degrees, and the hybridization of the central nitrogen atom is sp3. It contains sp3 hybrid orbitals. An sp3 hybrid orbital is simply a mix of one s orbital and three p orbitals. The hybridization of the hydrogen is simply s. And so that's basically it for this video. That's pretty much all we could talk about. So now you know how to draw the Lewis structure of NH3.